Today, we're gonna to give a comprehensive list of things you can do to maintain a healthy spine. Let's get started. Practice good posture. Be mindful of your posture throughout the day. Sit and stand tall, keeping your shoulders back and relaxed. And avoid slouching or hunching forward. Next, exercise regularly. Engage in regular physical activity that strengthens the muscles supporting your spine. Things like walking, swimming, or yoga. Strengthening your core muscles is particularly beneficial for spinal stability. Lift properly. When lifting heavy objects, bend your knees, keep your back straight, and lift with your legs instead of your back. Avoid twisting while lifting. That lifting and twisting motion is what brings most people with back pain into our office. Next, maintain a healthy weight. Excess weight gain can strain your spine and lead to back pain. Maintain a healthy weight through a balanced diet and exercise. What does balance mean? How about we start off with avoiding things that only increase your calories without providing proper nutrients. Nutrient dense foods will help you to be satisfied without eating too many calories. Next, avoid prolonged sitting. If your job requires sitting for long periods of time, Take breaks to stretch and move around. Consider using an ergonomic chair and adjusting your workspace to support good posture. Use proper ergonomics. Whether you're at work or at home, ensure your workstation is ergonomically designed to minimize strain on your spine. Position your computer monitor at eye level, use a supportive chair, and adjust your desk setup to maintain good posture. Sleep on a supportive mattress. Invest in a mattress and pillow that provide adequate support for your spine. Your mattress should be firm enough to support your body while allowing for comfort. Practice safe technology use. Avoid prolonged use of handheld devices, laptops, or tablets that strain your neck and back. Maintain proper posture while using these devices or consider using ergonomic accessories. Next, stay hydrated. Drink plenty of water to keep your spinal discs hydrated. Proper hydration supports the cushioning and shock absorption properties of the discs. Next tip for spinal health, quit smoking. Smoking has been linked to increased back pain and spinal problems. Quitting smoking can promote better health and overall well-being. The next tip for a healthy back, stretch and strengthen your back. Incorporating stretching and strengthening exercises into your routine can maintain flexibility and promote a strong back. Consult a healthcare professional like your chiropractor to learn exercises suitable for your condition. The next tip to maintain a healthy back, practice stress management. Chronic stress can contribute to muscle tension and discomfort in your back. So implement stress management techniques like meditation, deep breathing, or engaging in activities you enjoy to reduce levels of stress. Next, regular chiropractic checkups, of course. Visiting a chiropractor regularly for spinal checkups and adjustments is a key to helping to promote a healthy back. And here's why. Chiropractic is based on four principles. The first is the fact that our body has an amazing ability to heal itself. Our body heals itself, it regulates itself, it maintains itself all the time, all by itself, and you never really have to think about it. Like right now, your heart beats and your lungs breathe and your digestive system will digest the food you just ate. And you never have to think about any of those things. And what controls that? It's your nervous system. and. What happens is your brain sends messages down the spinal cord out of all the nerves to every single part of the body. And as long as that pathway is clear, our body tends to function really well. But different things can happen that can cause the spine to move out of position. Things like physical stress, chemical stress, and emotional stress. These different stresses put pressure on the body, eventually put pressure on the spine, causing little misalignments called subluxations. Those subluxations put pressure on the nerves and those nerves travel to different parts of your body. In some people, those subluxations can cause pain. In some people, those subluxations can affect energy levels. They can just affect how your body feels. Sometimes those misalignments can affect the way the body's functioning and you may not even feel it. You may not feel the blood vessels not functioning well. You may not feel organ function slowly declining, but these are things that are happening underneath without us even thinking about it. You don't want these subluxations. As a chiropractor, it's my job to make sure that we correct any of those misalignments in the spine. And as we do that, you are going to feel better, your body is going to function better, and you will be healthier in the process. That 
is chiropractic. And don't forget, hit that like button, leave a comment with your thoughts, and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching, and here's to a healthier, happier life. Have a great day.